All righty, though. Thank you for liking my team tweets, by the way. No worries. I, I appreciate the fact that you are, uh, A, you know, tagging me as the organizer and uh, also, you know, talking about Champions of the Fog. I appreciate it greatly. The more people who are aware of it, the better. As uh, I'm going to raise the team cap from 16 and push it up to 24 next season, so... It will extend the extend the league a little bit if you do 12 and 12. Yeah, so that would be a little bit of a longer league. So I might have to do more matches throughout the week. Potentially, depending on how long people want to have the league go on for. Alright, um... This map is god awful for Trapper now. It really is. The grass is so thin. Let's make it so captains don't count as roster. Yeah, how about nose of that one? All right, let's put a trap here. Close off meat tree. Um, let's grab this trap. No work on that gen. And no real place for me to trap there, unfortunately. 10% regression on that. That's always good news. I mean, if you really want to drop that pallet boy, be my guest. Do I think that's a good idea? Not really. I really don't. Begin down you, Surge Will Proc. Perfect. And now it's basement trapper time. Uh, let's put this trap right here. Looks like I'm changing my roster every week. I mean, remember that uh, you can only uh, add or have people uh, play after a seven day cooldown period. So uh, something to keep in mind. All right, we're putting you into back hook. And we'll go for that trap back here. And then we can trap the door. I'm gonna do it right on this lip. Try and hide it to the best of our ability. Uh, popped up over. That sucks. Here, another gen over here that was worked on but is regressing. And one more trap to really lock down that basement. No one's exiting that one. <laughs> It is basement trapper time. Oh, and look at that. Well, that is great timing. Because now we just kind of do this. And we're golden. Hmm. We saw scratch marks. Interesting. Might as well regress this gen real quick. Let's see if I can vault. Perfect. Got that uh, vacuum vault. Are you sure that's a good idea? Let's hit you. And now we have three traps going. Not on that one, not on that one. They're on this one. Is that the intro? It is not. Oh, Whitey boy. Hold down you for another surge. Yeah, I think they must have. Let's reset the trap. I hear Meg here as well, by the way. Hi there, Megan. You want to go inside? You might guess. Perfect. All right, let's put this trap back down. Put you on hook. Are you gonna try and crawl up, boy? So that's now gonna be two people in the basement after we wait out Dwight's potential DS. In fact, honestly, I don't care if he has DS. All right, so let's do our vacuum bolt. That way, we can avoid that. I guess I need to pick it up, though, one way or another, don't I? Oh, hi, hi there, Adam. How goes it? Wow, you got lucky, didn't you? I guess that saves me the trouble of picking up a trap, then. So that's going to be number potentially three. Meg's been unhooked. Let's see if they mess up. Let's drop you. Let's hit you down again. Well, it's in that case, pick you up. Hey, what's up, Pammy? How goes it? How goes it? How are you doing today? So we're going to put you in basement now. You could have deliverance, theoretically speaking. I'll have to be aware of that fact. Let's put this trap here. And we don't need to pick up a trap, thankfully, as we have the one that's been reset at the doorway. 
Meg now goes back up on Hawk, and that's now two people in basement. All right. Let's do that. Perfect. Let's retrap this now. And, uh, yeah, here we are. Not a bad situation to be in, to say the least. Now, obviously, they can still get out, theoretically speaking, but it's going to be pretty dang difficult. Let's grab another trap. Looks like a deliverance, as we expected. Now, they're probably going to have to disarm. This is where, like, Honing Stone would be amazing for us. Megan got trapped. That's unfortunate for her. Let's see if uh, they help her out. They do. Now, we know Deliverance was on Adam. All right, Adam boy. Let's break this. Go to the left. Now, you went to the right. No mistake. Did you? Where'd you go? Oh, yeah, you went to the right. Unfortunate. So, they reset that one. Let's keep that in mind. But it looks like they're going to try and stay as far away from basement as they possibly can. Hi, Megan. How goes it? Would you like to go to basement? I hear everyone's going there. It's the hot place to be. All right, they do get that. That's unfortunate. And I think we just saw another survivor over here. That's Dwight. Perfect. You want a vault? Perfect. That's two... That's a sweaty boy. Everyone's injured now, which is great news for me. But they have pushed me on to about a one-for-one -one ratio, so we're not on a two-for-one, which is kind of rough. Uh, we do have some traps coming up here, though. Let's break this. Go to the left, boy. Perfect. Yes, yes. Don't look. Don't look. Excellent. I want to say I may have heard another survivor injured around here, but I'm not certain. Alright, um, let's reset this since we already have a trap in hand, unfortunately. And that way might be able to get someone else there. Now let's check this gen. Meg was on it before. Makes sense for her to be on it again. No one's here. And what about Shaq? Shaq, Shaq could be a really dangerous gen to be on. They are not there. They are also not over here. Now, this pallet is down. I'm going to hide this here. They probably won't look there right away, which is good news for me. And... Doesn't seem like a lot of work has been done on gens. Oh, hey, Dwighty boy. How goes it? You really didn't want to be healed by the unhooker, apparently. Don't mind me. I also found someone else here. I believe. I could have sworn I saw him on the corner, but I guess not. Maybe I'm wrong. You have school in four hours? You should probably take a nap there, Trix. It's, uh, getting a bit late there. Okay. Where the hell is Dwight going? That's part I don't know. All right, let's forgo this chase for now. And pressure gens that I think they're on. It's only 4 a.m. Only 4 a.m., you say. Where is everybody? This is odd. Okay, there's one. Let's reset that. Ah! Hi there, Adam. Ah! I see you found my other trap. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna reset this real quick. Oh, you think you're cute. You think you're cute. Ah! I can do that. And pick you up. Shouldn't be able to wiggle, me, wiggle into me in time. Let's put you back in basement. And once again, we're in the basement. Very nice. Dwight, do you really think that was a good idea to be in here? Do you really think that was a good idea? Let's put that down. Sounds like they're on this gen. I'm going to try and get them to vault. No, they didn't. That's unfortunate timing. I wanted to get them going around for the vault. There is Megan with that. If she goes in, she dies. So let's retrap this. There's the unhook. We hit Megan. And then just wait for you. 
I mean, I'm not going to not down you. I'm just going to wait. Perfect. All right. Two people now in basement. Meg will go down in basement. Adam will join in a bit. And then other two are still injured, which is good for me. Oh, Adam boy. They're going to heal him in time, Dwight. Could be a dicey move. You are not. All right, let's pick you up, Dwight. And I know you're on death hook as well, so let's hook you over here. I think that might be the smartest move. And after that, we're going to put a trap here for Adam, in case he has a DS. Let's find out. By bullying baby survivors? Honestly, feels like it, but I think it's just late night matchmaking being a thing. Especially if cracked Evan. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, we've uh, put plenty of survivors in the basement, let's put it that way. And all that is left now is the Meg. Let's pick up this trap, I suppose. And what's the verdict? Hook? All right, we'll try and find her. No guarantees, though. If I do find her, I bet you she'll probably vault this window and chase. We'll put that there for good measure. And hunt down the hatch. Might as well go over to this tile and see. Doesn't sound like it. Doesn't seem like it's in middle either. And I don't see Meg on the exit gate waiting either. Not in the meat room. Oh, did I hear it? I did. There it is, perfect. Now, let's grab this trap. And hope to high heaven that she's over here. I think that crow may have come back. So we're going to chance it, put a trap here. And if she's not on the other exit, I think we should have this. Keywords, of course. Let's grab this on our way by, so we can also trap that Exegate, too. And this does count as a win, so this will be our third win in a row with the Trapper. Yep, which means now I can lock down this. So there's the uh, reset. Just in case she gives me the slip, I'll put that there. Will she have enough time to get that? That is the question. I'm not sure. This will be, uh, this will be a close one, I'll say. I think she will. I think she has the time. Yep, we'll have to interrupt her on a swing. There it is. You didn't get it in time, Meg. Like I said, you didn't get it in time. Just barely. Just barely. Unfortunate stuff. Yeah, I really just had to get that swing at the last moment possible. She really was almost there. Literally was a tap away. If she had Dead Heart, she possibly could have gotten it. Um, by committing to it, tapping it, then Dead Hearting through. If I hadn't anticipated the Dead Heart, she would have definitely got away. And 99 the door. I mean, that is what she did. I mean, I'll just put this trap here in case someone else uh, comes on by the basement. She maybe could have gotten it if she has a dead heart, I'd say. That'd been our only option. So we'll see if maybe that Meg had. If that is, that's a real oof moment, to say the least. But GG, well played to these survivors.